Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. We're just really quickly going to take a closer look at the new Kill Team trailer. Um, of course, everybody knows by now it's going to be featuring some new Tempesta Scions, as well as the long-awaited return of the Vespids. Um, of course, the second coolest Tau Auxiliary after the Crute. So jumping in here, uh, we have some sort of a new little unmanned um, walker turret for the Scions. Um, it's piloted by a servo skull there. Uh, it's opening up on some normal Tau Fire Warriors, uh, proving like a bit of a distraction there. I'm not sure exactly what that unit's going to be called in game. I don't think we've seen anything too much like that before, but it's definitely cool. Now, as it's distracting our Tau here, you see one of them look up and get shot in the face. And so this is the Scions coming down. Of course, now they have these little jetpacks, grav shoots, and right here... Uh, we can see there is a Scion that is dual wielding pistols. So that is the only um, new weapon option I can see, at least uh, from these um, Scions here in this image. There's a big cannon firing in the background. That's probably what they are here to uh, sabotage or shut down. Or, um, or maybe it's an Imperial one, but I'm assuming uh, it's, it's an enemy one if they're breaking in here. So the Scions drop down, uh, they start running forward, and we're going to get our first look at the new Vespids here in just a second. Buddy's looking down the scope, and right there. So they have the Vespids painted red here in this trailer, which they've always been blue before, but uh, still very cool. Now right here, I'm going to pause it, because we can see a Vespid charging into melee. Now the Vespids usually or were always uh, pretty okay in melee, like kind of equivalent to a Crute certainly better than a human so it makes sense that he's charging in there to fight him with his claws um this vespid here i'm assuming is the like strain leader or whatever um he's got that tau helmet um and as well as the that's the standard uh vespid blaster there which was pretty good uh, it's always been you know more powerful than a las, las gun um it's a pretty good weapon got the dual wielding guy shooting some down they're all firing back and right there i'm gonna have to rewind it uh, we have the new railgun uh, upgrade for the Vespid. They've never had this before. It's usually a Pathfinder weapon, um, but it looks like they are giving that to the Vespid as well. So, of course, that is going to one-shot um, most infantry in the game, even uh, heavy infantry. And then there's another weapon here, here, right here. Um, I'll just try and rewind that a little bit better. Nope third time's the charm maybe there we go um so we're not sure if this is some sort of a plasma weapon or it looks more like like an air bursting fragmentation launcher type thing but it fires like a plasma projectile but either way it blows up that crate the scions are pretty decimated i'd say they gave about as good as they got though we saw several uh vespids getting shot down it looks like the whole scion squad is dead now as well except for this guy who's missing an arm and that is the end of the trailer. So super excited for, uh, I th believe it is later today, uh, that they are going to be showing this off. And uh, of course, like all of you, I'm eagerly uh, waiting to see what all is going to come from this kit. Can uh, can all read the little blurb down below on your own time. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to kind of break it down and uh, see what little goodies we can glean from this trailer before they actually show off the kit. And uh, that'll be all for today, guys, and uh, thanks for watching, as always.